good, you. All right. Did you know if you contact Karen Batty at the uh, Phillips 66 Refinery, you are more than welcome to uh, take pictures of the refinery. Uh huh. Uh, all you have to do is get a pass. You really don't have to take pictures as long as you have a pass to do. Ma'am. <laughs> uh, no, I'm on public property. I know. I'm just saying, if, if, if you want to like, take pictures, I'm not saying you can't take pictures. Uh huh. Well, you're not going to harass me, are you? I'm not harassing you, but I'm just saying people are drawing a concern that you're out here taking pictures. And so that's why it says security out here. Huh. It's just, I'm just taking pictures. I, I get it. Yeah, I, that's I, it. I know it's simple, but yeah. that's why it's being interesting. All right. I'm just saying it, it would be a help to us that we wouldn't have to be out here if you just called and said, hey, can I get a camera pass? And she's like, sure. She's usually good about that. What, to go in? No, no, to take pictures. To walk on the road? Road. To walk on the road taking pictures, I mean. No, just to take pictures, period. I'm not saying you have to be walking on a public road. I'm just saying to take pictures. Oh. Well, I mean, the First Amendment covers any public property. You can take pictures of anything you can see. So you don't need permission from anybody to take pictures. Well, for the refinery, they, they ask each other a camera. That's what I do. I wonder what that does for somebody. Me neither. I have no clue. <laughs> I'm just saying that's, that's what they say. It's important that you have a camera pass. You can get, you, anybody can get one if you ask for it. Uh -huh. So it's not like we're denying them to people. Yeah. Uh, like you said, what does it do? What do they yeah. They just ask that you have one. Okay. Well, I'm not going to call her, but I'm going to take pictures. But I'm not bothering anything. I'm just taking pictures. Pretty sure you're not. Yeah, <laughs> I know I'm not. do it all the time. Yeah. Okay. I just wanted to come out and ask if that would be something you do what you do. Is this still a 66? Yes, ma'am, it is. Okay. I didn't know. All right. Thank you. Uh -huh. They get nervous because they have, you know, all the refineries are, you know, designated as a high risk for terrorism. Uh -huh. So when they talk with somebody, they come out. Okay. They check it out and then they call us. So. All right. They didn't tell me that they called. They just asked me if I would call someone and get a pass to do what I'm doing. And I said, you know, this is public property. I don't need a pass to take pictures here. Well, as long as you're on public property, you're fine. And just make sure you're not in the road, too, because I don't want you getting hit by a car or impeding the flow of traffic. Uh -huh. um, so as long as you're not in the road or on their property, you can take photos because you got to understand, you know, why they call. They get nervous when people see stuff. So as long as we come check it out and everything's fine, then it's not an issue. Cool. Okay? All right. Um, so I will do, like, a little incident report saying that I talked to you, okay. that you were made aware of what the rules are, you already understood that you sure. were on public ground and everything like that, so you can continue to take the photos. Yeah. Do you have a ID or anything so I can put on there who I talked to so they know if they get a future call that they can say, oh, well, we've already talked to her, everything's fine? Well, I didn't commit a crime, so I prefer not to. No, you didn't. I, but the only reason I do it is so that we don't have any future issues. It's oh, not because okay. you're in trouble or because you committed a crime. Yeah. It's so that my report shows I talked to Miss So-and-so. She already told me she's aware. She wasn't doing anything wrong. Everything's fine. Okay. So well, I prefer we, not we do to. do that anytime we go to. If you don't have an idea, I can take the name, too, and I'll put that on there. I prefer not to. Okay. Do you have a vehicle that you're traveling in or anything? Why? Huh? I'm, I'm walking, but why do you ask? Because it's snowing real bad out here. It's bad weather. I didn't yeah. know if you had to walk. Where are you headed to? I'm um, okay. But okay, thank you. Good? Yeah. Okay. So what's your last name, ma'am? I prefer not give that information since I didn't commit a crime and I'm not suspected of one. Okay. What's your hesitation to give your name? Are you afraid I'm going to do something with it? or? What would you do with it? Just write a report? Well, it's like I, yeah, it's not even a full report. It's an incident report. Uh -huh. So if you're still out here and we get a call and another officer comes, they can go, okay, well, Officer Ford already talked to whoever you are. Yeah. And then they know. Oh. Otherwise, well, I if I don't have to. a name on there, they're yeah. not going to... They're just going to know I talked to some anonymous female. You're probably going to have another officer out here that's going to ask you the same questions instead of just being done with it now. Well, that's okay. I prefer not to. Okay, thing. that's fine. If you don't want to identify yourself, just make sure that you stay off their property or it's trespassing, and make sure you stay out of the roadway or you can get arrested for that, too. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yep. Okay, man. All right, thank you.